Hello everyone and welcome to Driving Home, where we will be, well, driving home from a late day at work when we realise that we haven't refuelled the car and just to add on to the emphasis of horror, our cell phone isn't working so we need to try and find somebody to help us. So we'll see how that goes. It was a Thursday, November 16th, I was working late. I drove home. Oh, am I driving? Okay. Drive on the, the other side of the road. So yeah, we're just driving home. It's light. So. I don't like that I can look that far backwards. Oops, swerving a bit. Oh, yeah, I don't like that I can look that far backwards into the back seat of the car. That is a little bit off putting for me. Whoops, a little bit off putting for me. I'd rather not be able to do that. Speedometer actually does show my speed going up. Or just staying constant there. Um, oh, hello? Oh no, we are low on fuel. However, shall I continue to drive home? Just keep going. So ignore it. It's fine. Uh, okay. It's probably not fine. Hello? Don't swerve off the road. Okay. Try and get onto the side of the road if at all possible. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I tried using my phone, but I didn't get any signal. I decided to follow the road until I found a gas station or something. Wait, shift is to slow down. Okay, bye, bye car. I don't like that I have no sprint. Oh, I have a flashlight. Why you, sh why you shift slow down? I don't want to slow down, I want to run. What are you? Oh, it's a sign. Uh, anything about a gas station? No? Can't even see my car anymore. Hello, lonely traveller on the road? Anybody want to supply me with any fuel? Kind house. I saw a house. I decided to go there and ask for help. Kind sir slash madam. Please do you have fuel for me in my humble journeys of wanting to leave work. I knocked on the door but no one answered. I'll just keep knocking. Or I'll knock twice. That's what I wanted to do. Anybody here? I don't really want to peep into the windows. I think that's just trouble. I saw a back door which was open. Really weird. Yeah. Yeah, really weird. I thought maybe I could find a telephone to call for help. I... I don't I don't think I tend to just walk into people's houses. Bathroom. Hello? 
phone? What was that noise? I thought I heard something then. Like a squeaking or something from somewhere. I, I hear moving. And I don't like it. In fact, I think the volume might be a little loud or quiet. There we go, that's probably better. Um, phone at the front? No? What does that say? Breaking news. Garage door was locked. I need to find a key. What do I need to find a key? I thought it was after a phone. Which I still haven't found. Where's the phone? Where do I keep a phone in this house? I don't like the doors. Oh, key? Okay, so I found a key, but I'm still going to have a little bit of a look for any phone. Ah, phone. Right. Ahoy, ahoy. And I'm just putting off going into the locked room, to be honest, because... Nothing good is going to come from a locked room. Okay. You want to lock the garage door? Jesus! Um. Oh, I don't know if I'm allowed to show that. There's some... Oh, God. Um. Hi. Do you have any fuel I can take? Thank you. I took the fuel and decided to leave as fast as possible. Yeah, good idea. Can I go at the front door? Nope. At the back door. Oh my god. Run away. Okay. I started running to my car like a madman. While not holding shift, I will add. I swear it felt like something was following me. That's why I'm looking back. Oh. I was not ready for that. Once I get to the safety of my car, I'll refuel it and then drive away. Some may say I will drive home. Yeah, that was terrible. Can you be following me? Safety and salvation, which I'm sure is going to be absolutely fine. In fact, anything in the back seat? Always check your back seat. Um, do I, yeah, refuel. I refueled the car, now I can finally drive away. I mean, I, yeah, I, something's gonna be in the back seat because you can look back. So I know that's gonna happen. I'm looking at I'm looking at the wing um, the rear view mirror as well, just to see if anything pops up there. Bye house. I just keep driving? It's gonna happen. Certain things gonna. Oh. He's got a knife as well. 
Okay, I wonder how far you could have actually driven without actually looking back, because I turned. So maybe I could have like just carried on driving a bit longer. Anyway, that was driving home. A good little horror game. Um, kind of a bit expected. Um, the kind of things that got me more was the loud noises. I kind of expected something to be in the garage, um, but I kind of didn't expect just a loud noise. Um, so, yeah. It's little kind of predictable, but obviously when you've got a few minutes on a game, it can't you can't have things like a complex story of things coming out of nowhere so still a very good little horror game that was what 10 minutes long really really effective just in those 10 minutes so that's going to do it for this episode thank you very much for watching and I will see you next time bye